Hi everybody, welcome back to Time Predicts and a very very happy new year to you. I was on a holiday. A uh, special announcement, I will start, take per- start taking personal readings after a few days. I'm busy and unpacking and a lot of office work. So people who have contacted me via email, I will uh, reply in one or two days. And uh, for others who had appointments with me or wanted, I will start giving appointments, okay? So thank you so much. And today we are doing uh, exact date and time and they'll call you if it's a no con- contact situation or even if there's little contact and or if they've been hot and cold and sometimes they call, sometimes they don't. I mean, if that's uh, the uh, routine with them that sometimes they disappear, sometimes they are back. So also when you'll get a call from them or if you've been waiting for a call. So these are the dates and time. OK, so there's one blank. I'll keep it away. After that, we'll do some cards also. So let's start with Jan 8th, 19th. This is all January, okay? January 10th, 28th and 23rd. While talking to you, I also got 11. So I'm just adding Jan 11. You know, Jan 11 is important for a call. I just got that in my head. Yeah. So Jan 11th is important. You can freeze the frame and note the dates down. I've also got a lot of messages, okay? So, uh, yeah, the time that I get is 10 a.m. I get 9.04 a.m. I get 10.20 p.m. at night. I get 7.01 a.m. I also get 5.55. I have a lot of messages I'm getting 5.55. I don't know if you've, uh, you know, I get more like p.m. If you've been, uh, this also looks like 3.33. So it could be 3.33 or 5.55. They could be important for you, okay? these are the time so i'm just holding them closer here we put the time and the date uh some messages that might be important they're going to say talk to me or they want to talk to you okay they haven't spoken to you or you're not receiving their call uh for whatever reason between you two because this is a general reading there could be different you know um situations right now it's also unblock me so it's either they're saying unblock me or you want to get unblocked and get a call i think a little bit fight and you got blocked something similar to that two calls change of heart somebody has a change of heart like either you have a change of heart and you'll unblock them or they'll have a change uh, of heart and unblock you because they want to talk to you you know sometimes because of a misunderstanding the other person is really miffed or uh, you know is angry because at that moment they're angry so maybe this this is some kind of a blocking issue blocking i get blocked you know and um, you don't know their whereabouts maybe they're not really revealing where they are or what they're doing and that's making you more mad i also get two calls so maybe two calls or two missed calls okay these are some few words i got channeling uh, while i was writing i got rice maybe uh, they're rice eaters you're rice uh, you're a rice eater like you love rice or you just had rice while uh, watching this or just put your plate away i can see putting the plate away and especially i see peas also in my mind or in my vision uh, <coughs> sorry could be something to do with peas uh glue i got the word glue maybe used glue to stick something I also got a stamp in my mind i also saw two pages being stuck together you either separating them or you just sticking something you know like stickers or glue are you using glue like the stick glue I also got the word sunglasses. Maybe they like sunglasses. Maybe you like sunglasses. Maybe you bought sunglasses or you gifted them sunglasses recently. I got the word lake. Maybe you stay near a lake or something to do with the lake. And I could see a boat and a lake, you know, like a very lonely place, a foggy place where there's a lot of fog rising the mountains. That's what I see. I got the word town. So maybe you're in town. Maybe they said, hey, I'm in town. One of your friends would have said, I'm in town. Would you meet me? Sudden sudden call from somebody in town. Okay, that's another that I've just dropped in, you know, or uh, I'm in town. Do you want to meet me? That uh, Those kind of words. Uh, these letters could be your name or their name beginning. These letters could be any of the names beginning. I got M R A C P J K I F T S. I got the word fit. Maybe that's a new uh resolution of staying fit you want to uh, stay fit there's a kit maybe you bought a new kit to uh, stay uh, sorry to start your workout with something to do with a kit and uh, i got the word mac mac is uh, cosmetics but i don't know why i got the word pack pack could be you leaving from somewhere a lot of words also forming here i got the word jack use the word jack or the name could be jack or something to do with uh, rhyming like a rack you could have built a rack or something or 
something to do with a rack kept books in a, a rack also get the word miracle here if you see the letters are not all there but i got the word miracle something is a miracle okay something is an arc also an arc mark could be a name or something to do with marks you put a jack like tire changing or something i got i got the word stay you are someone to stay somebody is uh, going to ask you to stay oh i've got stairs i've got fountain maybe they're important to you in some way and uh, record voice so do you record voice is just recorded a voice like a voiceover but record or something to do with recording like a voice i mean especially sending a message to someone i got a blue bl butterfly i mean i don't know like a very beautiful blue like a light blue with some maybe spots but if you spotted a blue butterfly in a book or otherwise or seen a blue butterfly uh, i get two calls again you know probably two calls change of heart seems very important somebody has changed their outlook or their you know heart from uh, something had happened and a change of heart definitely like a more softer stand on something i hope you guys had a great new year oh look at this it turned i'm worried you will leave me also a lot of you asked me for the decks i can just send them in india uh not abroad and uh, i will also send the cost and uh, it doesn't come in a box so this is the hard deck and there's a couple deck with a lot of messages so i will also um you'll have to put an email again whoever wants the deck especially if you're in india india only it's difficult to uh, ship it abroad and uh, let me know i'm worried you leave me see somebody's had a change of heart they probably thought that you're not going to leave them or even if they block you're not going to go away or you're going to behave differently you know pleading them messages or something if they've even if they've not blocked you but you behave differently so now suddenly you know they're worried they're worried that hey uh, you know they're not behaving the way they do they're not worrying they're not begging me they're not coming after me they're not saying hey you know i want to speak to you or whatever so yes i'm happy with you so they are happy with you it seems like a good sign maybe this is a change of heart and maybe you know in anger they said hey you don't make me happy there's love at first sight this card has been coming out a lot maybe if you just met someone and this is a second date and you're wondering will they call me will they call me was it just a one date affair or one day thing and you know they're not going to call me back wow you've got happy twice you make me happy this is also you know twice yes i'm happy with you you make me happy so this is a confession also coming just not just calls but a confession with the call look at this let's give our ch uh, relationship another chance i told you a change of heart is like somebody said get lost <laughs> you know sorry i'm <laughs> not being rude but you know how when you're angry and you say things like that get lost i don't want to talk to you and this and that somebody's getting having a change of heart and it's also you know give our relationship another chance spirit guides please guide me and give me a message okay let's see that later oh wow look at this chariot fell right, right out of my hand somebody's coming towards you so they want to see this so I, so they so they'll be unblocking there'll be calls because this is definitely forward movement okay not just in a relationship or otherwise forward movement happening or you thought all was lost okay so uh you know definitely you see three things lost you know three cups have fallen but the good part is also there are two cups still standing so maybe the person is still wondering yes i have love from for them they did make me happy and a lot of times people focus on the negative but there is also a positive and there's a bridge that's standing oh look at this i said a lake or something and this card came out so maybe you stay across the lake or there's a lake around you something maybe your address has a lake in it like lake district or something lake 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 <laughs> and uh, there's a bridge it's still uh, you can cross the bridge or the bridge uh, um closes the gap between you and the person you know maybe they have to take a bridge to reach you something to do with a bridge uh, you know when the gap oh that also fell when the gap is bridged between two people wow yeah they've been fights you've got two fights see there were there was you thought everything was lost because the fights never uh, you know they seem never ending but definitely i think there was a blocking that time and there is a change of heart because they can still see there is love you know no matter what spirit guides please give me more messages so yeah there was a choice change of heart choice to leave or not to leave they were also thinking that you were thinking that whatever your situation you know you could be in very different situations you know you could be making choices or it could be like hey do they love me or not hey will they call me or not you know it could be like 
wondering what's going to happen between two things and there's water here again there's water fire and yes looking into your direction next three days could be important you could be a march born very calm waters a lot of water coming up okay lake that's why i wrote lake water a new direction maybe there's a it's a long distance relationship you haven't heard from each other but they are going to come towards you ready to be you know ready to go on a journey take on a new journey with you that's why you know let's give our relationship another chance a new journey this is also chariot chariot is movement journey you know when there's movement there's journey also towards something wow and you've got 10 of cups which is happiness all the way this is so beautiful so there is there is let's give our relationship another chance could also be that you married you have kids and you separated you want to give your relationship another chance okay i just want i have a spirit guide message okay don't listen to people around a lot of times people misguide you when you're in a relationship i mean they're like yes leave the person yes leave the person they'll not make you happy they won't make you happy but take the right decision i want to say you know like like an emperor does I mean, the emperor just does not make decisions, you know, based on hearsay or what other people are saying. The emperor always is wise, okay, listens to, uh, you know, the heart and the mind and makes a very balanced decision, a very wise decision. So I also got the word elephant suddenly. I don't know why. I also got stitching. Maybe you stitch something together. Maybe the relationship is going to be stitched something together. Okay, that's another thing that I got. I got the word red robe. Or maybe like a bathroom, like red in color maybe. But you got to make a wise decision, okay? You got to be wiser. The person you're dealing with is a lot wiser. Maybe that's why there's a change of heart. But don't listen to everybody. Uh, just uh, listen, uh, in the sense, listen to everybody, but make your own decision because you're in the relationship. A lot of times you get influenced by people around and it spoils our relationship, you know, because nobody say, oh, no, you should make it work. I mean, they'll listen to your side of the story and you're like, no, he's not good for you. She's not good for you. Whatever the gender. Wow, I kind of knew, you know, let me cover it. Otherwise, there's a problem. The lover's card is here. This is so beautiful. Look at this. The lover's card is so beautiful. It's like protected, meant to be together. Second chance. You're both manifesting each other, you know, and you've got the clouds out of the clouds. When they vanish, there is clarity. There are clear blue skies. It's almost like blessed. Both of you are blessed. Both of you could be destined to be with each other. That's why probably I got 11 and this is also 11. So maybe that's why January 11th could be a important uh, day in your life. Okay, that's also important for you. I got the word cactus suddenly. I don't know why. Okay, that's another thing also. So those were the messages and this is such a beautiful reading guys and let me know when you get the call and uh, they reach out to you or things change between you two for the better. That'll be great for me to hear and I hope you have a very good new year and I hope a lot of most of you all of you uh, should get together uh, back to the person you love. But remember if it's a toxic relationship please do not try too hard or do not try at all okay. So you know when to let go is also very important always in life. I know you hang on to hope, there is hope, but that's when it's a good relationship. Little things are wrong, it's fine. It's not that every relationship is perfect, but yes, and uh, yes, you know when to leave and when to stay. So for this one, I think they will make an effort, you will make an effort. There is a choice and this is rework in a relationship. There is movement in a relationship, there's happiness and lots of other um, signs you will get. So take care guys, bye.